the essential materials I use when raising, taking care of praying mantises. Let's begin. Now, of course, the first thing you need is a mantis. And right here, here's my adult, one of my adult female Chinese mantis right there. And there's a Chinese mantis nymph. So this is the first stage when they were first born and the adult stage. Now, depending on the size of the mantis you have, you wanna house it in a proper container because this little one is gonna eventually become that big and you need to have space or he needs space so when he molts, which is when they shed their skin, I will cover that in a future video. That's why you need the space and the mantis needs space to walk around but they like to chill on the top. And that's why the next item you need is a spray bottle to spray the top of their enclosure and give them water to drink. Now, you don't want to straight up like drench the enclosure because it might make mold and you don't want that. Now, what else do we need? Scissors, a pair of scissors to cut these little, I don't know, I think they're like reptile covers or felt. So I use that on top so you can cut it to make it a nice appropriate shape for both of them. And you can use the scissors to cut twigs because you need the twigs to have the mantises camouflage and just rest on them because they like to do that all the time and that's how they catch their prey in the wild so you want to mimic the wild in the enclosure so they're living a good life now the next item we're, we're going to cover is plastic gloves now you'd want this for the sole purpose of catching live prey or handling the food items because some people are squeamish yet you want to deal with insects but you can do both I can go with the gloves or just use my hands. And that's because you wanna lift up rocks to find prey, if you're gonna go that route. I'll cover that towards the end. So that's what the plastic gloves are for. Now let's see, the next is the food supply. Now things you need, I have this small net because it's useful to catch small flies so it can work. You can find these at like, I guess 99 cent stores. They're kinda, wonky they're like a toy but they work next up are containers for holding food and here's a mantis nymph that i fed a little while ago let's see if i can focus it he's eating so he's just sitting there and there's this container and right here i have an earwig now i found the earwig under a rock and that's the perfect size to feed an adult mantis now when you have a mantis you want to give it prey that's appropriate so I will cover that in the next video in one of my videos we're gonna go looking for prey now you can choose to like for nymphs you can buy food like flightless fruit flies and that works and then for the bigger ones you can get them roaches or super worms but I'm like very like wilderness I guess so I just lift up rocks and we're in my habitat so i'm going to be looking for their prey items in the next video